Hi, I'm Kristen Burt with Dance Network, and we are here for week one of the live shows for season 14 of So You Think You Can Dance. Let's talk about tonight because I always like to talk ballroom curse with you and I always worry about our ballroom people. I do too. <laughs> what are your initial thoughts? Let's start with Kiki and Jenna. Well, I have to be honest, you know, I'm just not sure like Nigel said whether America is going to get Kiki or not, because, but I will tell you that he is a phenomenally strong ballroom boy. Anybody in the ballroom business will take one look at the way that that boy dances. He's so grounded, his connections are so on. He's so manly about everything he does, you know, that every ballroom girl in America would love to have a little Kiki. I'm a little kiki. Their hand. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> yes. <laughs> I know I would. <laughs> and then you have Jenna. See, Jenna is hard uh, to take your a, eyes off. Yeah, she she is, but she could only dance that way too because of Kiki. And yes, part of the ballroom is to um, the guy is to present the woman. The woman is the star. And there are some guys out there in the ballroom world that take just a little bit too much. It's all about me. He did the right thing. He, you know was producing her at the other end of his arm and was really showing her off. And man, she, like I said, to me, she was better than ever because of him. But she certainly, like I said, one of the most well-grounded inside edge of the entire foot. You'll, if you watch that tape back slowly, and I probably will. Uh, <laughs> of course. And, and, you know, her weight on her feet never rocked to the outside edge. You will always see that internal pressure and strength from the inside of the legs all the way down into her feet. And she is solid. Nailed it. Yes, nailed it. <laughs> Paul and Sydney, let's talk about them, because kind of a different dynamic. Yeah, absolutely different dynamic with these two. Um, you know, she, you know, honestly, Sydney, I think, is a little bit taller. You know, it's not the same picture that you get, but she's a very strong dancer. Like I said, when that girl hits that fan position, her legs are crazy. To hear. That's right. They're up to here. They're actually, I think they're taller than Paul. Just her legs. No. <laughs> and he, you know, he's a very solid, of course, ballroom dancer. Very charismatic. He's got that smile and that Devon kind of thing going on. He looks like he's from the movie star from the 1920s or something like that. We like that. I mean? No. <laughs> well, I have to say, it's so wonderful to have you back. Your energy was missed in the studio, and you look incredible. So Thank we're glad you. you're here. Thank you. Yeah, me too. Could be happier. <laughs> we'll see you next week. Thanks, Thank Mary. Thank you. Thank you.